so volcano so what is volcano basically a volcano volcano refers to vent okay it refers to the vent it refers to the vent or the opening opening from where from where the uh, magma from where the magma from the interior of earth from the interior of earth uh, reaches on the earth surface reaches on the earth surface and what is volcanism okay this is volcano volcano basically is a vent volcanism basically refers to the entire process volcanism basically refers to the entire process of what the process of the process of formation of the magma the process of the formation of magma the movement of magma so here if the magma is formed if here if the magma is the is a form the formation of magma the movement of magma from the interior to the outer surface as well as as well as the magma reaching on the earth surface when it reaches the earth surface the magma when it reaches on the earth surface is called as lava it is called as lava so this all entire three steps the formation of the magma the movement of the magma from the interior of the earth and the pouring of the lava the pouring of the lava is called as volcanism okay recently there was volcanism have you read in the newspapers where was the recent volcano erupted in the world the entire world was shook have you heard about the tonga island where is tonga island which which island which ocean is tonga island there was a volcano in a tonga island it was there in a which ocean and can you relate some reason also we'll see the reason today we'll see the reason today the it was there in pacific island tonga island is a part of the pacific island it is it is there in the pacific oceans the reason was you will see a term often in the newspaper which is known as pacific rim or you can say the 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 ring of fire the ring of fire ring of fire or the circumo pacific belt circum pacific belt okay what is circum pacific belt what is ring of fire we will see that okay so here we are discussing about volcano what is a vent what is volcanism processes now whenever you have this volcano okay the the hot liquid the hot liquid within the interior of the earth within the interior of the earth is called as magma and when this hot liquid reaches the earth surface it is called as lava okay so here when the the magma is coming from the interior of the earth and where it is reaching on the earth surface don't you think this can serve as an evidence of the earth's interior it can tell me what is the composition of the interior layers of the earth so it serves as a evidence it serves as a evidence for the earth interior for it serves for as an interior now now the magma or the lava the magma or the lava okay on the basis of the composition on the basis of the composition of the lava on the basis of the composition of the lava it can be of two types it can be of two types one is the basic lava it is called as the basic lava and the other is the acidic lava the other is the acidic lava okay so basic lava and acidic lava so if i say basic lava basic lava is one which has less silica which has got less silica in it whereas an acidic lava is the one which has got more silica in it which has got more silica in it if it has got less silica okay so basic lava is more fluid in nature more fluid in nature 
like more flowy in nature it flows swiftly it spreads and the acidic lava which has got more silica it does not flow as swiftly does not flow as swiftly as swiftly now i'm done drawing two figures please tell me from this information that whatever we have studied which will be a basic lava which will be the acidic lava okay so if this is a volcano okay if this is the volcano from here we have the lava coming in if this lava flows and reaches up to a this is a okay and there is another volcano and there is a lava this lava can flow up to only this place which do you think out of a and b which do you think is more fluid in nature is more fluid in nature which lava is more fluid in nature this one is more fluid in nature so this will be what this will be basic this is more viscous in nature viscous okay something which is dense so it is more viscous in the nature because it is more viscous in nature it is it is called as acidic lava okay viscous in nature which is acidic in lava and this has got what this has got less silica this has got what more silica out of a and b which will form steep features on earth i have a question which will form steep features and which will form gentle features on earth which will form gentle features on earth which will form the steep features which will form the steep features b which will form the gentle features a correct this is this will form gentle features whereas this will form the steep features okay right this is what you have to understand in volcano can volcano serve as an evidence of the earth's interior yes on the basis of the composition of lava we can tell about the minerals in the layers of the earth right we can see if there is a steep steep feature we can say it has got more silicate minerals whereas if it is fluid we can say it has got less silicate minerals so here the lava composition the features can help us know about the minerals in the interior of the earth